we have the, all our, our gestures and uh, stay on somewhere in the space. And the cut, it be really, really, really easy and really, really uh, quick, just in one second, because I think that the, the light is very uh, yeah. 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 And the music will. And the second thing, uh -huh. uh, what I think is, nice. it is good, it is a good idea, because uh, there is this possibility of Eigenarten, which basically means that um, we as students, we can meet, we can connect, uh, we can develop an idea for a project, for a theatre project, with people from different departments, and uh, we can get support from the university. So for us it's a great possibility to um, do things on, your, on our own and to, to try out what directions interest us, where we would like to go, within this um, frame of the university. You have two more oh, left. Yeah. Let's, change change what the, yeah, let's think what we can do with yeah. your four. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe okay. Okay. you can change the couples, then they're not the same couples that the same. Okay, who will be uh, diving into a dream? Because this dive can be and someone all from will catch here. this person from Daniela, here. From here. Daniela. Yes, I, I, or, here. Or, or, or. we searched for people who are interested in such project and I know that Anna was doing the same here in Munich in the academy uh, then we had still contact via internet we settled um, co common um, group on Facebook where we contacted and then we started to work like on the workshops firstly uh, people from from here from Munich they come to came to Bitom and we made some imp improvisation yeah we said okay let us make something about Heimat and then everybody was uh, thinking about what Heimat is for him and that was the most the biggest problem because then everybody was talking about air hey, heimat for me is this and this and this and it was so much it was such a big topic and um, um, we found out for us that we can't get one point all together it doesn't exist this heimat that you can make a, an explanation out of it the heimat is like this and this and this and so we asked everybody to make a little monologue to write on his own what's heimat for himself. We as a group, I mean, we didn't really choose each other because we didn't know each other or we chose each other by not knowing each other. Um, but in the end, I thought, I think we found a really good way to um, to work together. And of course there are differences, but um, they are not specific of um, our nationalities, I would say. But in the morning they instructed the gardener to dig up the roses. We are using text of Olga Tokarczuk. It's Dom Dzienny, Dom Nocny and Bieguni, so it's Unras. And what is really nice is that Olga Tokarczuk is solving this problem of maybe not Heimat, but having not, no, no roots, like uh, of people which are always, all, always traveling, always looking for a place where they can uh, stay, but it's not it's not for them, it's not suitable for, for them. For me, the most important is that I think we get such a personal um, connection to this topic. It, we try, we really try to find out what's our expression of Heimat and with our, uh, in a way, style, when I can say it like this.
you are trying to use language not as just spoken words, but also trying to do something more artistic with it, more somehow not use, not just tell the story, but also uh, give it to audience w with some special uh, form, not like because we are using using really strong um, bod body form. Like, 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 like